So I think there's a there's a, there's a conversation happening around you know to what extent is sustainability compliance, and to what extent is sustainability actually an opportunity driver, right? Is it is a competitive advantage? And I think the answer to that is that it's actually everything. ESG sustainability is going to end up in your business model from top to bottom across the value chain. So a good example today is the corporate sustainability reporting directive. Yes. And when it came out, people said, hey, that's a disclosure directive. It's a reporting directive. But looking closely, it's way more than that. It's a governance directive. It's asking companies, can you explain to us how you're set up internally? Who's behind this? Who are the individual leaders that are part of the governance around ESG? And I think this is where Data Marin is focused in terms of the use cases that we serve. So we look at helping companies to figure out where to focus through data-driven double materiality. So we analyze 400 different topics across regulation, across media, across reporting, and help companies with insights so they can yeah. say, oh, that's where we should be headed. It's a fast evolving space. Yep. There's no way to do it without technology. So that's also where we see the power of AI and tech tools today to essentially help companies monitor what issues potentially should be in your shortlist and can be removed.